Hi guys, Justin here. Welcome Farm 26 and uh, we're over by the cornfield. I like to know what I've got in there. For Just thought I'd give you a little update. Uh, I'm six foot tall and this is kind of what we're looking at for corn, but there is some ears here. They're not, they're not huge. They're not what I'm used to, but uh, we're gonna pull a couple and we're gonna go shell them. And we're gonna see what it is because, man, I never, I've never tried to do this, but uh, Pulling a husk off one handed isn't the easiest. But there you go, I mean they're they're not big but they're something. But when you bite down to them, they're uh, as far as like cattle feed corn, man, they're real close to uh, they're real close to high moisture corn, you know. And I just kind of, well, here they're getting better. I mean, I'm, I'm, the camera's about 5.5 five right now. I mean, better than what we walked through. There is, there is some stuff that got over six foot, but it's not, uh, it's not good by any means. Or good quality. I shouldn't say quality. It isn't good. Uh, well, the, the drought got to it, you know. It's been starved. We'll grab one here off a little better. And I know you can't see, I gotta, I'm gonna shuck another one. And just biting into a kernel. Yeah, it's starting to get chalky. I mean, I, I can't put it in the bin yet, but I just want to know where it's at. There, I got you kind of propped up against the truck bed. I'm, I'm going to go walk and get a couple more. There you go. They're not uh, anything to be proud or too proud of by any means, but uh, yeah, there we go. So now that we got a few cobs, that's kind of why I keep this old stuff around. Uh, we're gonna give it just a little shot of oil. And this hand crank, He's the one you really want to make sure he's got some oil. If you don't, he will, uh, he'll get your arm. I don't know if he, I don't know if he's strong enough to break it, but I know he sure hurts like, like none other. There you go. A little shot of oil. All right, let's go see what our moisture is. First, we got to shell it though. Got a little bucket underneath. Now 
there you go. It doesn't shell it perfect, but I don't know if you can see this or not. Yeah, we got a little bucket of corn now. Makes life uh, not so bad. There. Maybe you can give them a good mix. Because this is a this is taken from all over the fields. You know, it wasn't just one spot. It wasn't one hill. It wasn't the best. It wasn't the worst. All right. And I'll be back. I just heard something pull up. All right. So let's uh, let's see what this is. Give her a turn on. And this is the hard part, the whole weight. Rape seed, let's go to corn. Too dang many uh, options on here. Corn, high moisture, test. Because I know it's not dry, it's not combine. We know that. And it's thinking about it. 31.2. So it's drying down. Uh, it's a little higher than I thought it would be, but it's drying down. All right, well, that's why I keep this old stuff around. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, catch you next time. Have a great one.